you got here because you suspect that you have a fuel or an ignition system problem. We're going to discuss the inputs, the internal workings, and the outputs for the ignition module as they relate to fuel and spark. The ignition module must have good B+. It has to be within a half a volt of battery voltage. In this example, our charging system voltage is 14 volts. Our measured voltage at the DIS module is 13.8. We're good to go. If you don't have good B+, go to the charging system and find out why. Ground voltage drop must be less than a half a volt between the battery negative and the module's ground. If it's greater than, find the problem with the wire or the ground and repair it. Crankshaft position sensor and the camshaft position sensor are used by the PCM for both ignition and fuel injection timing. They both send a signal to the ignition module. On some modules, the cam signal may go directly to the PCM. This is a different schematic we're showing you as a different example. You must use vehicle-specific schematics every time. These are Hall Effect sensors. They must have good B+. In this example, a good B+, is 10 volts. Always use vehicle-specific spec specifications. Never work from memory. Ground voltage drop must be less than a half a volt between here and the battery negative. Internal module ground voltage drop must be less than a tenth of a volt. In this example, on this schematic, in this vehicle specific schematic, we're measuring between pin M and pin K for internal module ground voltage drop. If the voltage drop is greater than a tenth of a volt, the module's bad. Always use a vehicle specific wiring schematic. Crankshaft sensor signal is one of the most critical signals on the vehicle. The example that we're using here has a dual crank sensor. You can see that there's four wires going to the crank sensor. This is an 18x signal. This is the sync signal, as labeled in the schematic. Both signals go from 0 to over 5 volts without missing signals or noises. So when you get your scope pattern up there, they should look like this without any missing events. The sync signal is used by the ignition module to identify which coil pack to fire. 